Hey guys, this is Exodus Gear, and today we're going to be going over how to properly hide your CG Miner window. And I'd like to give a special thanks to Van Reiner. Now, I want to say I hopefully pronounced that right. I hopefully didn't slaughter his name. But uh, with his help, we actually got this set up. The first thing that you want to do is find the directory where you saved your CG Miner. Mine is located on my C drive in the CG Miner folder. And the first thing that you're going to want to do is right click, create a new text document, and I will name mine No Window CG Miner. Alright? Now, for some of those who haven't figured out how to create BAT files or any other kind of files, we'll go and go over that real quick. Go ahead and hit Alt, it'll bring up the menu up here. Hit Tools, Folder Options, go to View and make sure that height extensions for known file types is unchecked. Once it's unchecked, hit apply and hit OK. We'll go ahead and go into the text file now. Go ahead and hit edit. And the coding that's in here, I'll actually go ahead and post it into the video info. So all you have to do is go down there and copy it real quick. Now there is one change that you need to make like I said earlier you do have to find your directory right here you're gonna put where the bat file is in your directory so again for me it would be C drive CG minor and then the name of my bat file which would be mineworldcoin.bat alright now when you go to save be sure to hit save as you're not gonna want to save it as a text document you're going to erase the TXT at the end, and instead you're going to put VBS. VBS. So Victor, Bravo, and then we'll put in Santa. Why not? It's Christmas. So go ahead and hit save, and it should actually create the file either right above or right below where your text file was. You can now actually get rid of the old text file, so delete that. Now, whenever you double click, this file, nothing's going to come up. Instead, what you're going to have to do is go into your Windows Task Manager, and right in here, you'll actually find CG Miner already running. Now, let's go ahead and go back real quick. I want to check and make sure that it's up and going. And for some weird reason, Blocks Factory isn't updating right away. Well, it's somewhat updating. You can see that I have one valid share already. There we go. So I've got one valid share. Um, it's just the site itself. Sometimes it takes a little bit to update. But again, if you go back to your Windows Task Manager, CG Miner is running, and it's running at the settings that I put into my uh, advanced command line. So it's actually a very simple process. If you want to shut it down, of course, you have to come in here, hit end process, and that'll shut it down. And that's it. Very simple, guys. I hope this helps somebody out there, and enjoy.